Ah, excited by the idea of seduction. Let's explore the captivating world of human connection with a more candid approach. As we enter deeper into the world of seduction, imagine yourself navigating through a maze of emotions and desires, where every twist and turn brings the potential for an exhilarating encounter. Seduction goes beyond mere charm. It's about building genuine connections that leave both parties longing for more. Picture yourself sitting across from someone, feeling the tension in the air as you share a laugh or a meaningful glance. It's those moments of vulnerability and authenticity that forge bonds stronger than any calculated move. But let's not overlook the importance of ethics. While the temptation of power and control may be strong, genuine seduction stems from empathy and respect. It's about understanding the impact of our actions on others and navigating the complexities of desire with integrity. So as we journey further into the mysteries of seduction, let's keep our hearts open and our intentions pure. After all, true connection is the ultimate prize, far more valuable than any fleeting conquest. Seduction isn't just about surface-level charm. It's about forging authentic bonds that resonate on a deeper level. Imagine the thrill of engaging in a genuine conversation where laughter flows freely and sparks fly effortlessly. It's about creating moments of intimacy and connection that leave an indelible mark on both hearts. So as we move deeper into the forbidden secrets of seduction, let's do so with a mindful approach, grounded in authenticity and respect. After all, the most profound connections are those forged with sincerity and genuine affection. Think of these techniques as tools in your toolkit, like learning to dance or play a musical instrument. They're not about trickery or manipulation, but rather about enhancing your ability to communicate and connect with others on a deeper level. Imagine yourself in everyday situations, like chatting with someone new at a party or having a cozy moment with your partner. These techniques aren't about making you a super smooth talker or a mysterious charmer. They're about helping you be yourself and form real connections with people around you. So let's approach this exploration of seduction with humility and respect for ourselves and others. It's not about winning someone over or getting what we want at any cost. It's about building mutual understanding, empathy, and respect in our relationships. First one in the list is neuro-linguistic programming. Ah, neuro-linguistic programming, NLP, a potent technique in the world of seduction and influence. Picture it as a kind of mental sleight of hand, where words and gestures become tools to shape someone's thoughts and emotions without them even realizing it. Let's simplify it. Neuro refers to the brain and how we process information. Linguistic relates to language and how we use it to communicate. And programming suggests the patterns of behavior we develop over time. Essentially, NLP is about understanding how the language we use can directly influence our thoughts and actions. For instance, imagine you want to convince someone to try a new restaurant. Instead of just saying, let's go there, you could use NLP techniques to plant the idea more subtly. You might say something like, I heard about this amazing restaurant where people feel completely relaxed and enjoy the most delicious food. Can you imagine how wonderful it would be to experience that together? By using sensory language, relaxed, delicious, and associating positive emotions with the idea, wonderful experience together, you're subtly guiding their thoughts and feelings toward your desired outcome. NLP can be a potent tool when used responsibly. Next technique in the list is emotional anchoring. Emotional anchoring is like planting seeds of emotion in someone's mind, creating powerful associations that influence how they feel about you or a situation. Think of it as tying certain emotions to specific experiences or memories, so that whenever those experiences or memories are recalled, the associated emotions come flooding back. For example, let's say you're trying to make a memorable impression on a new friend. Every time you meet, you bring along a small gift or token of appreciation, like their favorite snack or a handwritten note. Over time, they begin to associate the joy and warmth they feel when receiving these gifts with you, strengthening their emotional connection to you. Similarly, in a romantic relationship, 
You might create special rituals or traditions that evoke feelings of love and intimacy, whether it's cooking dinner together every Friday night, or taking a spontaneous road trip to your favorite spot. These shared experiences become emotional anchors that deepen your bond and keep the flame of passion burning bright. By strategically anchoring positive emotions to your presence or interactions, you can cultivate strong emotional connections with others, making you an indispensable part of their lives. It's about leaving a lasting impression that resonates long after you've parted ways, ensuring that your influence remains deeply ingrained in their hearts and minds. Next in the list is fractionation. Fractionation is like an emotional roller coaster ride. You're constantly taking your target from highs to lows and back again, keeping them on their toes and craving more. For example, imagine you're on a date with someone and you start off by showering them with compliments and affection, making them feel on top of the world. Then, just as they're getting comfortable, you suddenly withdraw your attention, leaving them feeling uncertain and craving your approval once again. This repeated cycle of intense emotions can create a sense of emotional dependency and susceptibility in your target, making them more receptive to your influence. However, it's important to use this technique responsibly, as it can have profound psychological effects on your target, if not handled with care. Imagine you're taking your target on a wild ride, swinging them from moments of euphoria to sudden dips of uncertainty. For instance, say you're in a conversation with someone you're interested in. You start by sharing deeply personal stories, sparking a sense of intimacy and connection. Then, just as they're opening up, you subtly shift the tone, perhaps by introducing a light-hearted joke or changing the topic altogether. This sudden change leaves them craving the emotional high they felt moments ago, making them more susceptible to your influence. But remember, this technique should be used with caution, as it can have profound psychological effects if not handled responsibly. Lastly, let's talk about subliminal persuasion, a sneaky little technique that flies under the radar. It's all about planting seeds in someone's mind without them even realizing it. Picture this. You're having a conversation with a friend about your favorite vacation spot, and you casually slip in how relaxing and rejuvenating it was. Without even realizing it, your friend starts thinking about going there themselves. Another example could be in advertising. Have you ever noticed how certain commercials or ads make you crave a particular snack or drink, even though you weren't hungry or thirsty before? That's subliminal persuasion at work. They use subtle images or messages to tap into your subconscious and plant the idea that their product will satisfy your desires. It's like planting a seed in fertile soil. Once it's there, it starts to grow and take root without you even noticing. So next time you're trying to influence someone's decision or behavior, consider using a little subliminal persuasion to nudge them in the right direction. Just remember to use it responsibly and ethically. As we wrap up our journey into the world of seduction, it's like closing the door on a treasure chest of secrets. But hey, don't lose hope. There's still a whole ocean of juicy seduction stuff out there waiting for us to discover. If you've been hooked by what we've talked about and you're itching for more, hit that like button and drop a comment below to let me know. With your support, we can keep the adventure going and uncover even more seductive secrets in future videos. Remember, seduction is like a thrilling roller coaster ride, full of surprises and excitement at every turn. So let's buckle up and get ready for more thrilling adventures together. Until next time, stay curious and keep the excitement alive.